Okay, so at least it's only one box. I'm only getting one box from the BoxyCharm add-on, pop-up, drop shop, whatever it's called now. I only did one box this month. I think, I don't think I have anything else coming, but I might. But this is kind of heavy, so I'm excited to see what I got because most of the time I order and I didn't even open the tape yet. I order and then I forget because I like think of it as Christmas. Now, if you don't know, I only get the BoxyCharm base box. I actually canceled the premium box and I never did get the Lux box. And the reason for that is because every single time that I got the premium or the base box or I was getting both, there were so many items that I wanted and I didn't get. So I would see all these unboxings and be like, oh man, I wish I got that. I wish I got this. So to save my money, so to speak, what I do is I kept my base box because that was my very first box. That's the one I started out with. So I kept that one and then anything extra that I want that I didn't get in base or I didn't get in, in premium, the specific items that I want, I just go and I get them at the, like the drop shop or the mega drop or whatever they're calling it because you're getting them like 60, 70, 80% off of the retail price, which comes out cheaper to me. So that's what I do. So, oh my gosh, they're actually wrapping stuff now. Look at this. And it's not a huge box for one item. This is strange. I never get anything wrapped in tissue. This is weird. This is strange. Okay, so it's wrapped in tissue. So let me give you a sneak peek before everything falls out. So that's, can you see it? That's what it looks like. And let's go ahead and take a look and see what I got this month. I did not get this and I wanted it. And I saw it in the drop shop. And this is actually, I have another mist this is actually the hyaluronic hyaluronic acid peptides antioxidants pineapple glow mist i have the another mist and this is from um clean skin club and i wanted the pineapple one because i needed to know look at that i have another one like this and i think it's blue the one that i have and this one said pineapple and i love the smell of pineapple so i wanted it so that's what i got and it is a nice clean like um clear jar i don't know how this works this is a pump what do we do let's see okay so it sprays but where's the sprayer thing oh there's a sprayer so it's got a sprayer right there I don't smell pineapple. It does. Sm it's got a really, really nice fine mist. It doesn't have a real pineapple smell though, <laughs> but it smells good. It doesn't smell bad, and it's just like a really, really nice fine mist. I'm not mad at it because I love, I love, love, love mist. I, I actually use them when I'm putting on my makeup, when I'm transitioning and putting some powders and stuff in it. I actually use some mist. So this, I'm really, really happy to get which of course I purchased, so of course. Um, this I haven't had in a while. This I got maybe a year ago in a BoxyCharm, and this is from the Honey, Hey Honey line. This is their um, lip balm. It's a trick and treat lip balm, and it's berry balm. And this has actually got like a berry tint to it, and I used mine all, I well, I kind of squeezed the, the, the tube, and it created a hole somewhere else, so I couldn't keep using it. And I really, really like it. But this is what it looks like if you haven't tried it. I really like this balm a lot. And it's got like this, this tint that's this color. So it gives you a slight tint, but it is a lip balm. So I do like that. So that's why I ordered another one, of course. Um, this here is from Bally Balm. It's a pineapple lip scrub. This was in another um, box. I don't know if it was premium or base box. And I didn't get it. So I did order it. And this is what it looks like. It's from Bally Bomb, and this is what it looks like. It just comes in like this little tube, but this is actually a lip scrub, and oh, it smells like pineapple. Ah, that's what it looks like, and it's definitely full. It's got that texture like a lip scrub, so it does have like that sugary type of texture to it to help you exfoliate your lips, which I need. Lately, I don't know what happened. My lips seriously dried out a lot and I, I only use like lip balms and stuff like that on it and lately they're like really really dry my lips literally feel like if I'm using like a matte liquid lipstick at all times really really dry like that so I'm really happy to get this 
Um, the next thing I got is Big Bang. This is the Big Bang Mascara by Aether Beauty. And this I got because I do love mascaras. I love it. I didn't get to try this one, which I usually get a mascara in every box that I get because I do have that I like mascaras in my profile, but I didn't get one and other people did and I wanted it. So I got it. So this is what it looks like. Is it good? Is it bad? I don't know, but I'm going to go ahead and give it a try. Now I have um, like three that I use. Um, one is from Maybelline. The other one is, it's the one that pumps up. You don't unscrew it, it pumps up. I forget what it's called. Um, that one I absolutely love. I love the formula of it because it's not too wet. I never have flaking or smudging as well as the, Lord, uh, the Maybelline one, which the Maybelline is in like a white tube. Really, I got to show you the next time that I'm on here. And then I also have another one, which is um, Dominique or something. I forget who it is. And that one's got like a, just a thin... Um, a thin wand and I use that for my bottom lashes and I love that for the bottom because it doesn't smudge so this is what it looks like kind of looks weird it definitely looks weird it is definitely a wet wetter formula but it is really really black so I I'm gonna go ahead and give it a try let me get some more information about this any information on this um no not really. I'm going to have to give it a try and I'll let you know what I think of it. But since I didn't get it, I wanted it. Another thing that I got was from Persona. Um, it's another lip liner. I think it, no, it's another eyeliner. I love this eyeliner. This is a, a black eyeliner. Um, it's a pencil eyeliner and I absolutely love it. I got this last month in one of my 15 million um, unboxings that I did for the drop shop. Um, or mega drop shop or whatever it was and i love 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 it like love it that's what it looks like if you don't remember and this is so good especially for tight lining i actually have it on my eyes now as the eyeliner and i tight lined with it and it doesn't smudge it doesn't go anywhere it like stays all day and i have not been able to find a black eyeliner that does that that i can actually tight line and it tight lines and it doesn't leak or run on the bottom um line or anything like that lash line so i'm really really happy about that so i got another one then i got this from this is a four piece brush set from i love brushes so anytime that that brushes come out and i don't get them i go and i buy them so this is actually from complex culture which is an ipsy brand but i don't get ipsy anymore either and this comes with four um brushes but look at them look at the handles these are so luxurious looking and they've got like the gold on them as well. Oh my gosh, I have to like, how do you take, oh my gosh, yes. So that's what they look like. That is just, and this is like a fluffy brush. So that would be like a nice crease brush. Um, so I'm just gonna put this back on here. There we go, just to keep it like in place. Um, then this one is more of like um, a little bit stiffer of a fluffy brush. And then I've got um, this one here. Wow, that's a really, really nice. This would be good for like highlight. Um, so I like that one. And then I've got more of a tapered down um, type of brush. So I'm happy about that. So I've got four new brushes. And again, anytime that I see some really, really nice brushes that I don't have, or if they're like, um, I and if they have Luxie brushes, I usually have, I usually get those. I've got the big ones, I've got the medium ones. And then um, there's more brushes from moted or m-o-t-d so i got those as well because well why wouldn't i because they're brushes and i don't have them so if i don't have them and i need brushes because i've got a million of them then i just go and i get more brushes so i don't mind getting eyeshadow brushes in my subscriptions because who doesn't need an eyeshadow brush so yeah oh and by the way i have this liquid that i use to wash all my i my brushes and oh my god is it such a time saver and it's just amazing it's like 45 dollars. it's a big big jug like this and it's just amazing and it cleans my brushes so good but anyway so that's what the brushes look like from motd um this is really nice because this helps me like with eyeliners and and um up close um it's not really like a pencil brush but it's you know you can use it that way and then these are just like fluffy brushes they feel good a little bit stiffer than i thought that they would be 
but not too stiff. So I'm happy to get those. But again, I love, love, love brushes. And last and certainly least is going to be this brush here. And this is actually, what brush is this one? This is Lovecraft Beauty. It's a number two brush. That's what it looks like. And it's got like a checkered um, handle. Isn't that pretty? I had to get it because it just looked really, really nice. And it looks really fluffy. So this would be nice for like, um, maybe like, well, there goes a the hair. Maybe like um, blush or, um, I don't know yet. I don't know how I want to use it. I just wanted another brush. So just to recap, I got this brush. I got these brushes. I got the complex culture brushes. I got another black eyeliner from Persona Cosmetics. I got the Bally Balm um, lip scrub, which I'm really, really excited about. I got the lip balm by, um, by um, do, 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 Hey Honey, which I really like. That's actually, this is a repurchase. This is a repurchase. This is a new purchase. So this is the Big Bang Mascara, and then this is a new purchase. So yeah, so I, I do do, if I run out of something and I like it, I do go ahead and purchase more. So yeah, so that is everything from this month's, I hope it's this month. If not, then I'll have to be back. But that's what I got from the first drop shop when I made my choice item, which was on, uh, I want to say the 11th of the month. I don't know. It was the second Monday of the month. Um, and that's what I did and I already got it. So I'm really, really excited about that. So yeah, so let me know, do you actually shop in the drop shop? Do you get any BoxyCharm items, any of the boxes? Again, I only get the base box now that I pay for and then um, all the other ones I did cancel, but that way I can actually spend the money that I would for the premium box to actually get the items that I wanted. And most of the time I'll get like an eyeshadow palette if I really, really want it. Um, or something like that if I didn't get it, but I'm really really happy with what I purchased This is probably like my favorite purchase so far that I've made, you know of new items So let me know your thoughts down below if you're not already and you want to be go ahead and hit that subscribe button right there Don't forget to hit the bell notification so that you're notified anytime that I upload a new video And let me know do you have this kind of problem that I have like by shopping the drop shops the glam that I don't even know what they're called anymore But do you have that problem too? Let me know down below and we'll go ahead and talk about it and I will see See you on my next one. Bye.